Hey everyone, in today's video, we're going to be roasting a whole chicken. This is a winner for dinner. We're gonna start with our compound butter. We're gonna add in our stick of butter. Uh, I roasted a whole bub of garlic, so we're gonna add that in there. Then we're going to add in our chopped fresh rosemary, our oregano, our dried thyme, salt, onion powder, smoked paprika, black pepper. And we're gonna add in some cayenne pepper, just for a little kick. We're going to give that a good mix until it's nice and creamy and combined like this. I'm gonna set that to the side. Now with our chicken that has been cleaned and dried, we're going to put in some fresh sprigs of rosemary in the cavity of it, also some lemon wedges, and some thick slices of fresh onion. That's just to add extra flavor. Now what we're going to do now is take our fingers and separate the skin from the breast meat. Very easy to do, but be careful. We don't wanna pierce it. We want all of that compound butter to go inside between the skin and the breast meat. Get all down there in those legs, separating that skin if you need help. Get you some scissors. And then we're going to take some of our compound butter. We're gonna put it under the skin of our chicken and we're gonna smooth that out all under the skin of that chicken evenly. That's gonna make it tender, extra seasoned. Don't forget those legs. Then we're going to turn our chicken on our breast side down. We're gonna do the exact same thing on the back. We're gonna take some of our butter and we're gonna smooth that under the skin that's been separated. Then we're gonna take our butter and we're going to smooth the outside of the skin as well. We don't wanna forget the season, the outside of the skin. So both layers are seasoned. We're gonna take our baking dish. I'm using a cast iron skillet. I'm gonna turn it back side down and I'm gonna take the rest of my compound butter and just smooth that on the outside of that chicken. We're gonna take the two legs, we're gonna take butcher's twine and just simply tie a knot, a bow, whatever you wanna do. Just keep those legs together and we're going to put that into our oven. We're gonna roast that for an hour and a half at 375 degrees and afterwards you got a beautifully roasted juicy chicken that is perfect for basically any kind of event. I paired it with some broccoli and a sweet potato. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. It is my whole roasted chicken. Enjoy.